What is the difference between IUI and IVF? Intrauterine insemination is the first line of treatment used for patients with unexplained infertility or mild male factor. In intrauterine insemination, the processed sperms are directly injected into your uterus near the time of ovulation. The male partner is requested to produce a semen sample before the procedure. The semen is then washed in the laboratory to separate the modal sperms from the seminal fluid and concentrate the best moving sperms together. Sperm washing also improves motility, which improves their ability to fertilize the egg. Processed sperms are put directly into the uterus. This shortens the distance they have to travel to reach the egg that has been released into the fallopian tube. In in vitro fertilization, IVF, your ovaries are stimulated, to produce more eggs by giving fertility medicines, and the growth is monitored during this period by ultrasound scans and blood tests. When enough eggs have developed in the ovaries with optimal size, the final hormone human chorionic gonadotrophin is given to trigger the maturity of eggs. The eggs are then retrieved surgically and are fertilized outside the body with your husband's processed sperms using conventional in vitro fertilization, IVF, or intracytoplasmic sperm injection, ICSI. The fertilized eggs are cultured in the incubator and the embryos are transferred back to your uterus, either on day 3 at 8 cell stage or on day 5 at blastocyst stage. Need help in getting pregnant? We provide a free second opinion for all infertility issues. Visit our website www.drmulpani.com to know more.